So I'm going to be doing a cold start routine in the F-18 to show off my prowess. Then I am going to be uh, taking off, and then I am going to be landing on a carrier. That is what the plan is for today. So it's, it's going to be an interesting one. I can, in fact, start up an F-18. Um, last time I did, though, I, I didn't close my canopy all the way, and I lost it. Which, you know, that was slightly embarrassing, but we're going to do better this time. we got to learn from our mistakes. That's what they say. So, APU on. Now I'm going to close the canopy. And I'm going to make sure that it's closed all the way. So, APU switch is green. So, left, so right engine crank. Wait until it reaches about 18 or tw between 18 or 25% RPM. Then right engine to throttle. I mean, right throttle to idle, and wait for that to stabilize at 65% RPM. I'm going to arm the ejection seat. Alright, it's stabilized. So, left engine crank now, wait for that. Alright, 20 RPMs, left engine to throttle, left throttle to idle. Alright, turn on our DDIs, our AMPCD, and wait for the engine to get up a little bit, and those should turn on. Alright, so um, all of our screens are on, so we can turn off the APU. It should be stable at 65%. Yes, indeed it is. Let's turn on our HUD, then our HMD, tech, menu. Alright, so uh, AMPCD, so now we're going to turn on our OBOGs. OBOGs on. Um, radar to operate, INS to ground. Ejection seat is armed. Alright, uncage the SAI. Um, uncage standby attitude or altitude. Turn on our, our RWR. Alright, all of those are checked. Um, now we just need our bit to work. FCS restart. So we're going to turn our INS to nav now. Should be able to restart this now, right? FCS restart. No, I guess not. Huh. I have never been able to figure out how to do these bit tests. That has been something that I don't understand. Alright, so now we need to turn our dispenser bypass on. That's something that I oftentimes forget to do. ECM to standby. That's my jammer. And there we go. FCS is good. Yep, there we go. Alright, now we're going to taxi right over there and we're going to go ahead and take off first though let's get on our nose nose wheel steering to high and should be good to go all right we do want to get nice and lined up here though uh, which we should be now we're gonna get our launch bar down and now we're gonna give ourselves a little bit of help here because we don't have a ground crew that can assist us in these regards so oh yes that is perfectly lined up mostly all right now you keep Okay, we're, we're there. Now let's make sure that we don't forget. Get our wings down. Also, sorry about the frames. For some reason, the Marianas is just terribly optimized. It just doesn't make much sense to me. It should be better. I mean, there isn't even that much going on yet. It seems... It, it just lags so much. DCS really does need that multi-threading. We've been cleared for takeoff. So just as a formality, we're going to salute. We have everything right. Let's see. Boop, 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 boop. Meow. All right, gears up. Now we are going to make sure to land this thing. <sighs> so something I don't really understand is why my AOA is off to the right here. Because for landing on an aircraft carrier, I am sort of going to need it. <laughs> but it doesn't work. I've tried adjusting my trim here, hitting the reset button, but it still doesn't quite work. That's my thing with the F-18. I just don't understand. That's really the tough part. There's so much technology in it, and it's so advanced, and it's very nice, but I just don't have any idea how to use it. And, oh, look at that approach. Beautifully uh, lined up. Every, every last bit anticipated. Goodness gracious. I just, I just turned around, and I was right there, lined up with that approach. It was... I didn't even have to try. I'm not going to trust my LA indicator whatsoever I'm just gonna eyeball this which is easier said than done especially when landing on something like an aircraft carrier I will be getting the F4 Phantom and this is good practice for when it comes out you know 
just eyeballing the carrier approach, because that's what you're going to need to do. But I am getting blown off course by something. But we're not quite going to catch center line. But we did catch the deck. Alright, about center line. Which wire did we get? We caught the second one. Ew, gross, disgusting, terrible, ugly, horrid, horrendous, garbage, trash, literally horrible in every way. Alright, whatever. Well, that's gonna have to do. Um, I guess I'll, I guess I'll turn everything off. Turn off, turn these off. Turn off my PCD. Battery switch off. Um, we're gonna turn off our engines. Alright, there we go, there we go, um, radar to off, to off, this dispenser bypass to off, as, and this one also to off, and we're gonna unarm the ejection seat, yeah, so that's the F-18 cold start takeoff and, uh, landing as well as the shutdown, as, as far as I know how to do it, so thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed, bye.